What up, internets? Nick Ketsubs from Fool's Gold, Danny Brown, Fool's Gold Records, Bruiser Brigade. We are in Long Island City, Queens for the MoMA PS1 warm up bio from Vampire Weekend DJ now. The Stallions are gonna DJ, then we're gonna rock, then the one and only Just Blades. This is a nice little family affair. I'm psyched, man. I'm, I hope that there's like just ill grandmas and stuff, like like un unsuspecting civilians <laughs> who are just kind of like they get into it. I always love seeing like parents like rock out. What's your favorite song in the set now? To perform Blueberry. Yeah, that's my <laughs> Even though I never really, I don't know, I never could finish it because I get so tired of halfway, but. Danny Brown and the UK producer Darky Freaker have this track that's bananas. It's mm -hmm. called Blueberry. We didn't even put it out on Fool's Gold, but I'm still shouting it out because it's a dope track. <laughs> I noticed that the people get into Piss Test too. Yeah. Piss Test is a song that A Track did featuring Danny and Juicy J. It kind of has like that wobble wobble. Yeah. Kids like the wobble. But yeah, that's fun. It's always fun to perform Piss Test. That's an easy one. I mean, I mean, um, I'm writing a new album right now. Like that, <laughs> working just doesn't sound cool. But the thing is, now I'm just getting so scared. I'm getting scared to record it because it's that good. I don't even trust the person pushing the buttons right now. <laughs> like, man, <laughs> it's that good. <laughs> This is Just Blaze, we are here at MoMA PS1. About to have some fun, get up on stage and you know, just do what I do. I have routines that I do, but I don't really have sex. I just go with whatever I feel at that time. Allow me to reintroduce myself. My name is Ho. Thanks to the I used to move snowflakes by the I guess even back then you could call me CEO or the to be honest, a lot of my best stuff comes up under the pressure of the moment. I get to that moment where I'm stuck and I can't figure out what to do next. And then something just hits me out of nowhere. It's like comes from somewhere else and I'm just like, oh, why have I never done that before? I mean, I've known A-Track since he was pretty young. Met a couple of times when he was DJing for Kanye. I'd see him at shows and kind of just always stayed in touch. A few years back, he had a fool, his first Fool's Gold Out holiday party. And I played and he was like, but here's the thing, I don't want you to play any hip hop. I want you to play all house music. And I was like, perfect. I'm from Jersey, so, you know, that's where the house music capitals of the country. So I, I grew up on just as much house as I did hip-hop. I've been DJing since I could walk. My mother has pictures of me um, holding records up at my first birthday party. You know, it's, it's kind of cliche, but it kind of just has always been in my life. It's kind of in my blood. It's just what I do. Yeah. 